We cannot have any trust that Jason Kenney is sincere about confronting systemic racism as long as he continues to have Paul Bunner working in his office. For five days, Premier Kenney has refused to fire his racist speechwriter, Paul Bunner. Premier Kenney knows that Mr. Bunner has a long history of writing and publishing hate, starting in the late 1990s and continuing as recently as 2016. Two of the articles that we found speak directly to the conversations we're having in Alberta right now about systemic racism and violence towards LGBTQ2S plus people. Now, it's painful to read that Mr. Bunner published a hateful anti-black racial slur, a word that was just as hateful in 2003 as it is today. In the article, Jason Kenney's speechwriter says, quote, everyone knows that race is the defining element of violent crime in Canada today. And, quote, ethnic minorities are disproportionately involved in violent crime on both sides of the border, but at least Americans admit it. Bunner then goes on to smear indigenous people, black people, South Asian people, and East Asian people as violent criminals. He writes about, quote, a Jamaican ghetto in Toronto. That writing was hateful in 2003. It's hateful now. These disgusting stereotypes fuel the very systemic racism that we are grappling with right now in Alberta and across Canada. 